Gimme, give gimme, give gimme, give gimme, gimme, gimme. <laughs> Welcome back to another episode of Minecraft. Or, uh, Minecraft Hardcore Survival with Les Bill Dill. Where he's gonna show you how to take a diamond and turn it into the Ender Dragon. And we're gonna kill the Ender Dragon because it was a diamond. That's exactly how it's gonna work. But I'm not, no, no, no. Anyway, this episode I'm thinking we're gonna be probably trying to shoot for a, uh... Uh, an enchanting table, so because we already have our four obsidian, we need just two diamonds, and then on top of that, we're going to need a book. So we have to go find some leather. So I guess we're gonna be hunting for a goddamn cow while these things grow down here. That's probably what we're gonna go to do. So I'm gonna go start hunting for a cow, I guess. Also, sorry if I sound a little bit out of it this episode. Um, I know last episode I said that I was kind of tired, or not last episode of this, but last episode of my channel of the, the Rimworld thing. I know I said I was kind of tired. And there's a lot of stuff going on. And now it's more of just me being really fucking exhausted. <laughs> it's like 1 4, it's 1 15 in the morning. And I've had like four hours of sleep. And I want to die, but I need to get this done because there's a lot of stuff going on <laughs> that I need to make sure that I, oh my god, it's just, it's just time management. Okay, you know what? I've decided I'm just going to fucking dig a stairway up because I'm sick and tired of having to use this stupid, like, shaft over here that I have going on. So I'm going to quickly just kind of start doing this. I mean, I have a diamond pickaxe, so I might as well just use it. Um, it might make things a little bit easier for us in this hardcore world. I'm not gonna lie, I really, really, really enjoy doing Minecraft for YouTube, though. It's really fun. A lot more fun than I thought it'd be. Oh my god, it's got, it just got black for you guys. There we go. I, I can't let, can't let it be that dark. Because otherwise you guys can't see anything, and I don't want that. No, no, no. Minecraft is actually really fun to record for me, mostly because I just enjoy it so much. Oh no. Um. Okay. Uh. I don't see anything... Particularly, oh god, there's a zombie. Oh shit. Okay. okay, good. He's dead. Um, son of a bitch. Let's see here. Got some coal here. Ooh, coal. Ooh. Give me, give me, give me, give me, give me, give me. All right, I had my fill for the day. We gotta go pick up some iron here. I'm gonna get all the iron that we can. Because the more iron, the better, honestly. And especially in Minecraft, the more iron, the better. Okay, so this cave is actually quite extensive. Um, I don't actually know if I'm going to explore all of this. I don't see really too much of a point in doing this, so I'm just going to kind of go back. Um, hey, actually, you can see the old... Uh, tips for the um torches on the left and how they work because i'm telling you this this keeping the torches on the right side of the cave at all times is honestly just it, it's a fantastic like thing to do it honestly helps out so much with trying to figure out how to get out of a cave like my god um okay actually here's where the staircase is see right, right when you start seeing torches on the right side you you know when, when there's like a turn or whatever that you need to take and my god it helps so god dang much it's insane okay um anyway i'm gonna continue building this staircase up oh god this is about to get interesting because we got to go find a cow and we need leather we need leather badly so our goal is to get leather um we get some of this dirt here for the the farm because we're definitely gonna need the farm we need need the farm if we're gonna survive because we need food um please don't be a creeper please don't be a creeper okay all right um so what we're gonna do is build like a little hobble around this. Okay, so we got the hobble built. Okay, it's not meant to look pretty. Okay, it's not supposed to look pretty. How the fuck did you just get in here? Did you just like spawn? What the hell? How did you? All right, I'll just place the torch. Okay, fuck it. I I don't care enough. I don't, I really just don't care enough. I just want torches. Okay, I just need a few, not a lot, but anyway. So no, we we, we our hobble does not need to look good. Okay, it's just got to serve its purpose. Um, now we must begin the hunt for the cow. Um, ah, son of a bitch. Come here, cow. Come here. Come out. No, 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 please not me. Uh, well, see, Piggy, I'm looking for a cow, but I guess you'll serve your purpose, too. Because you are very good meat. I have spotted the target. We must go get him. Charge, lad! Charge! 
Come here, you fat fucker. I'm gonna turn you into beef and use your skin for a book. Come here. No, 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 not me, not me, no, no. Come here. Come here. All right, good. All right, cool. He gave us that. Um, we need sugar cane now. Fuck. What we definitely could do is just use the sugar cane we got. And just make like a little mini sugarcane farm. Those are not hard to build. They just take a little time. But we could do that. And then we could get stuff that way. Although my main concern is just getting some basic enchantments and not really advanced ones. I'm really, really regretting not making this thing like three blocks high. Or four blocks with fucking uh, stairs. Because stairs make things so much easier and faster. But it's not that big of a deal. I'm just... Ah. Could have made it better. Again, I want to apologize if I seem like I'm tired, because I really am tired, okay? <laughs> but th I gotta get a video out, you know? And plus, I like making them. It's just I'm tired. That's all it is. Okay, it's nothing bad. It's nothing bad, okay? I'm just... Ah, fuck. Okay, anyway, give me the sugar cane. We gotta make some pages for a book. Make the book. Good. And then what we can do is we gotta get the diamonds. Good. Gimme, gimme. See if I can remember how to do this. It's been a long time. I think it's just this. Yeah. Okay. Then what we can do is place it. Where should we place it? Here? Yeah, here. Yep. Cool. Okay, so we have lapis, which is what we need to enchant. Um, put that in there. We'll also put in the coal. Now, what we can do is enchant our pickaxe. I'm thinking, correct? All these are unbreaking. Or there's an efficiency. Should we just do efficiency to make it faster for us? I'm thinking that's the play. I'm thinking that's the play. Yep, Inf efficiency we're going to go with. Okay, Um, we should enchant our armor as well. So I'm going to take off all my armor. Um, Then let's just do this. I guess. Uh, is there any fire protection? No. Alright, so the best one we got is protection. So is oh, that was actually pretty good. There we go. Hell yeah. Projectile protection. Is that the play? Is that the play? Do we do projectile the protection? Bla we're, 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 spe we're specifically thinking about blazes. Um, when they shoot the projectiles, do we take projectile damage? Or is... And we're, and we're just better off going with protection, I guess. Looks like we just got a bunch of protection armor. We're going to need to find some more lapis. It shouldn't be hard, because we did come across some. I don't think I mined it all back in one of the other episodes. Um, let's throw the helmet on. Put the sugar cane back. Actually... Actually, you know what? I'm going to go ahead and make the sugarcane farm quick. Um, I don't remember if they updated it so you don't have to... You can just walk across the stuff now, right? I, I thought I heard you could just do that now. Like, that's like a thing that they added in. If I remember correctly, I believe that's an update. If I'm wrong, tell me in the comments, okay? But I don't remember. Um, I think you can just walk across farmland now. You used to have to crouch across it, but I think you're fine now. Anyway, I'm going to make the sugarcane farm, like, right here, so... I'll probably time lapse this. Oh, baby, a triple! Oh, yeah! Damn, son, where'd you find this? Do you honestly think you're fucking funny? Seriously. Okay, so we ran into one big major problem with the uh, sugarcane farm, and that's we don't have enough dirt or sand to fully make it. So we're just gonna have to deal with what we got. Um, I'm gonna put the water down that needs to be put down. Um, so basically, for all you guys who don't know, you can easily make a sugarcane farm just by making like a tunnel like this that has like the underground thing for the water because sugarcane needs to be mixed to water. Okay? It has to be directly adjacent to water in order to grow. So if you dig a tunnel like this and you just like dig like a little like, um, like what, what would you call it? A carpet out of the wall at the bottom. You put the water in here. You can just fill like a huge line of sugarcane like this and this is the way that I've always done it and I've seen most people do it this way because then what you can do is when the sugarcane is fully grown you can just run straight down spam clicking and looking like this and you'll just break it all and catch it and that's like in my opinion the most efficient way of doing the sugarcane I'm sure there's better ways to do it like automation and stuff like that but in terms of what we're trying to do this is the best way to do it all right so I am going to grab some more dirt because we are definitely going to need this if we're going to expand that sugarcane farm a bit. And, um, what else are we going to need? We need to get some more, um, lapis. Yes, lapis. We definitely need lapis. We we already went on the quest for the cow. Now we need the quest for the lapis. After I've quickly filled in a few more of these 
dirt blocks, that is. Because this is important. Let's quickly do this. Actually, we might have enough. Oh my god, we're one fucking short. Are you kidding me? Before we go on a lapis hunt quick. Alright, yeah, we're gonna go on a lapis hunt. Wish me luck, lads. Whoa, 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 whoa. We found something. We found something big. I don't quite know what it is. It looks like an air pocket. Or actually, an air pocket. No, it, it, what, what the hell's going on here? I've never seen this. It's already... Okay, um, these magma things we gotta be careful of because they suck down. They also hurt you if you touch them. I know that much. Um, it's like an underwater cavern with like weeds and shit. That's a thing. Since when is that a thing? What? This is so weird. An underwater cavern. This is really cool. What? Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Hold up. Alright, here's the way to get around this. Oh, well, no! That trick doesn't work anymore. You can't do that anymore? Ah. You used to be able to just throw down a torch and it would refill everything. Oh, man. That, st that stinks, man. God damn it. Okay. Come on. All right. Let's, we're doing scuba diving, boys. Okay, here. We found we found the air pocket. Um, is there any lapis? We're looking for lapis. Uh, okay, hold up. There's gravel here. Pause the avalanche. Okay, that just made it worse. <laughs> Son of a bitch. Um... Come on. There's gotta be something here. Aha! We have found Lapis. Okay, I'm happy. We found Lapis. That's what we were looking for. Um, how much did we get? Nine? Okay, that should be enough for a little bit. Um, definitely not enough to make us completely happy. But it's enough to satisfy my needs for now. And then we, next episode, we can finally fucking go into the nether and deal with these blazes or go hunt them or whatever. Because we gotta find them. We gotta find the nether fortress. Okay, that's gonna take ages. <laughs> That's actually probably going to take a longer normal like recording session than I'm used to because finding that shit takes ages. And we are going to finish enchanting the helmet that I have and then I'm thinking we might end the episode there. Um, this episode was definitely not exactly the most eventful thing in the world, I understand, but I need to get something out for you guys to enjoy, at least something. Okay, I was going to do RimWorld, but I want the RimWorld videos to be really enthusiastic. These ones are a little bit more laid back. Well, kind of, I guess. I don't know. That might be kind of a lie. Okay, I don't fucking know. Okay, I'm just I'm just trying to trying to do something, you know? Trying to be make you guys happy. Okay, there we go. Good. We got that. And why are the enchanting options disappearing like this? Why why is that a thing? Do they just not appear anymore? Is that a thing? Like what's going on here? Stop that. Why? Why is that happening? You don't need to do that. It's, that's just dumb. Like, stop. Why? Sweeping edge? Oh, isn't that like, uh, when you swipe your blade, it does more damage or whatever? Something like that. Um, yeah, no, we're not doing that. It's, uh, I guess we can make a diamond sword. I mean, there's no, there's no real point not to do that. I guess we might as well do that before in the episode. Quick. Quickly. Quickly, lad. Okay, wait. Oh, fuck. I forgot to make it. Ah, uh, fuck. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh, there we go. Make the diamond sword. Diamond sword looks so weird now. Why? Why did they make it look so goddamn dumb? Oh my god, of course. We got jack shit for the enchantment. That's okay. Um, anyway, next episode, we will finally be adventuring into the nether. Um, hopefully we got some more food. I might go, actually, what we might do is cook some of this or start it. Um... Anyway, I think I'll see you in the next episode. Sorry if this was a little bit of a weird one, but it was fun, and I will see you, uh, well, later. Bye. <laughs>